G'day gamers, Ranger Tony here, back with more of our Skyrim Anniversary Edition Arbalist playthrough. When last we left off, we had finished the uh, mission all the way up over... Where is it? It's not even showing on the map. Up here in the Forgotten Vale. Um... And the next thing it wants us to do is to come back and talk to the guys at Fort Dawnguard. But I have changed my mind just a tiny little bit because um, we got three of the five Paragons. And I've looked into it a little bit more. And... I want to get the last couple and get all the advantages of those. Now, I'm not sure what exactly the said advantages are. Um, I just know that I used one of them on that gateway and there were some nice little hidden chests behind wherever it went. Well, apparently each one of those, you each one of the, the paragons can be used at that same gateway and they take you to hidden locations. So we need to find the other two paragons and do that. Now, I didn't really, it didn't really twig with me at the time, but you may remember in the last episode, I deliberately did not kill a couple of frost giants because live and let live, they're not immediately hostile to you, but they have the paragons. So uh, we've got to go back and we've got to get the paragons. Now, what I'm also thinking of doing uh is i think i have um let's have a look we have a black soul gem there we have six grand six empty grand soul gems there what i'm thinking of doing is i know i just sold my um my bow my dwarven bow of souls that i had made up But I'm sort of thinking of making another one. Um, and then seeing what size souls I get from those guys. I am pretty sure it's going to be grand souls from them. And then, as strange as it is, because this is not really something that I would normally just do for the sake of it, but I might... I might go and just look for some regular giants and see what souls I get from them and how easy they are to take on with my current crossbows. Uh, so what I should probably do, I wasn't sure, maybe I should just make another, I wasn't going to make another ebony crossbow i was going to just make something else but um let me just uh let me just quickly check something uh probably should have planned this out a little bit more beforehand but the ebony crossbow unmodified without any skill in crossbows does 25 damage um, and that is equivalent to a glass crossbow right and then beyond glass there is stalrim daedric and then dragon bone so I could make a glass crossbow, or I could 
What is my smithing level at at the moment? 86. We're not actually that far from getting Daedric smithing at 90. I don't really want a Daedric crossbow just yet, but it will do more damage than my current ebony crossbow. And if I grab all of the good stuff that I've got, I could make a glass crossbow that's as good as my ebony one. Um, so, a glass crossbow is going to be... I don't think I've got the firewood to be frank about it. Uh, no, i got to go and get some firewood. Everything else will be fine. I'm pretty sure I've got... If I don't have the refined malachite and moonstone, I do. Uh, I, I could easily go and get it. Let's go... Super quick. Actually, let me just triple check. There is no... There's no firewood block down here. There's that stuff, but that's not the block that we need. And there definitely isn't one up here. Like, we can't have been missing it all this time. No, I wasn't. Okay, unless... It's sort of smuggle. It's not... No, it's not around the side here. No. Can't do it in the middle there. Not there. Yeah. No. We're no good. Okay, so... Not that. Three firewood. Just double checking there wasn't anything here. That identifies. As a firewood block. Nope. Okay. Oh. Who's there? Get back here. We fast travel now, because they're not that close. Good. G'day D-Bills, how's it going? Actually, horsey, get me to where the uh, wood chopping blocks are quicker, please. Excuse me. have less than 2,000 bolts on us. wonder if I should make some more.
Like, seriously, I was getting a little bit antsy in the last stream when I noticed that I was starting to get below 2,000 bolts. It's ridiculous. I'm never going to use that many. But I've had such a huge supply of bolts on me for so many streams now that it's like I feel like there's something wrong if I have only you know 1800 bolts i don't understand it but it's it's yeah it's a weird feeling but it's happening so anyway not to worry we'll get this firewood we'll go back home we'll make a super powerful glass crossbow put the soul stealing enchantment on it and then we will go back to the forgotten veil and find those missing frost giants and see what souls we get off them. So we'll put on our enchanting gear and grab that. Um apparel now we need actually is it worthwhile I got all that silver ore fine moonstone refined malachite Got all of that quicksilver ore. Got a calcium ore. Got moonstone and that ore. Got all that gold. Let's make up a whole bunch of ore. G'day Havoc. Uh, so we can make a couple of ebony. Quite a few gold. Very good. Okay. Uh, so we don't forget, we will make a glass crossbow. And then the enhanced glass crossbow. And then we're going to wait a sec. Now, uh, switch over to jewellery. We can make a gold diamond ring. We can make two of those. Is there any... It's not like a silver diamond ring. Okay. Uh, the silver emerald necklace is worth 830, or the gold emerald ring. Ah, that's just normal emeralds, okay. I suppose I should just make all of the gold-based stuff that stands out. That's a lot of jewellery. Right, I've got my...
I got my uh my missing gear on. Uh let's drink our potion. I think I've got a couple there. Yeah. 30% better for 30 seconds. That's okay. We're only improving one thing. And that is the enhanced glass crossbow. So both of these bows, I think, should be doing the same amount of damage. Uh, actually, no, grab that potion out of there and we'll put it... in there with those and then we are going to equip that that and that and then we're going to put away oh and we need to equip that we're going to put away that 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 and where's the other there that rest of that can be sold i could enchant all of that to make it worth even more but the fact of the matter is it's going to be hard enough to sell all of that stuff anyway. And I actually may not sell it. I might just leave it uh, in my little chest downstairs. We will have to see. I think that's right. Uh, okay, we wanted to grab the black soul gem out of there. And then we, oh, and these. And then I just want a grand soul gem to enchant. this legendary bow enchant uh, soul trap soul gem there we go grand soul gem right so let's have a look those weapons should be doing the same 376 361 I must... Oh, that might be because of the enchantment on it to do shock damage. Anyway, it doesn't matter. 361 is still a huge amount of damage. Not a problem. Let's go and put that uh, woodcutter's axe away. Uh, we're going to favor that. Let's redo our quick... Uh, so... We'll actually make that and candlelight five that will work all righty so i don't have any more empty soul gems up there no good so uh let's just double check in here if we had any Empty soul gems, canticle bark, orphan oil, lots of potions. Oh, more emeralds. I could have used those in enchanting. Ah, leave them for the moment. Uh, another flawed vala stone, or whatever it's called. But greater soul gems. I might just grab those as well. I don't want anything less smaller than that, though. Um, Oh, in case somebody who's just like, I don't know what the word is, but can remember everything that happens. I did actually grab everything that was enchanted in here after the stream last night. 
and quickly take it upstairs and there was one item I don't recall what it was that I got an enchantment off but that was it I put everything else back then uh, okay so let's go back on to the Forgotten Vale. Shrine of Learning, Shrine of Resolution, Dark Ball Passage, Temple Balcony, Shrine of Radiance. Let's go to the Temple Balcony. I want to talk to, it's good to, speak to you again. Knight Paladin Gelibor again because there was these books that we found, which I think we're supposed to show him. Why do Blood fill me with joy to see the Chantry back to its former glory? That time has long since passed. Now that my brother's dead, it's quite possible I'm the last of our kind. There's no need for that kind of talk. I said it was possible. It's also quite possible that there are some other isolated conclaves of Snow Elves nestled elsewhere on Nern. I'll also assume Bertha didn't exactly give you the option to stay your hand. For the time being, I will remain here, on the Overlook, and continue trying to keep the Sanctum free of the betrayed. You're always welcome to return here at any time, of course. The bow was said to be carried by Oriel himself into battle against the forces of Lorcan in ancient and mythic times. Its craftsmanship has no equal anywhere within Tamriel, and possibly beyond. The bow draws its power from Aetherius itself, channeling it through the sun. Therefore, when an arrow is loosed from the bow, it produces a magical effect very similar to being burned by fire. That's actually only a fraction of its potential. With sun-hallowed arrows, you would be able to produce a much more spectacular effect, causing bursts of sunlight to envelop your foes. The sun bursts would certainly hurt anything, but is especially devastating to the undead. I never found Oriel's shield. Well, using an arrow with the bow that's been dipped in blood may cause it to function differently, corrupting its purpose. That's, of course, if you're foolish enough to try it. I can actually assist you in that regard. If you were to bring me some good quality elven arrows, I could imbue them with the proper incantations and rituals. I feel nothing but sympathy for the betrayed, despite my actions against them. But I'm afraid that they're well beyond a cure at this point. The twisted forms you've seen didn't occur overnight. It isn't a plague or a disease that ravaged our species. The dwarves may have stolen their sight, but it took many generations for them to become what they are today. Perhaps they'll never return to their former appearance, but over the centuries, I've noticed a rise in their intellect. If a line of communication could be established with them, maybe they can find peace. It's the only way they'll discover that they weren't always malignant. They were once a proud and prosperous race. Okay, so... Um... I thought the books that we found in that quest was supposed to be returned to him. Let's have a look. Was there more information about those books? Oh, no. 
if I take them to the College of Winterhold, Urag gives me, he will purchase them for a thousand gold each and also give me a translated copy. Where is number two? Ah, I need the Emerald Paragon. Okay. Which of the Paragons do I have? Let's have a look. I have Diamond, Ruby, and Sapphire. So I need the others. Uh, that's not what I'm looking for. That's not what I'm looking for. Go back to here. Uh, no, not walk through. Quests. Items. So. What do we say? We've got the diamond. We don't have the emerald. We have the ruby. Ah, oh, we don't have amethyst. Okay. Amethyst and emerald. The shri okay, let's go to the Shrine of Learning. Uh, Shrine of Learning. There we go. Apparently, there's a giant northeast of the Shrine of Learning, which is potentially up there somewhere. Maybe we'll go this way first. This was a mistake. No? He's a feral Falmer. You're not. Oh, you are dead. You're the one that she summoned. Never quite get over that. Um. don't know that we actually we must have been in here before because we didn't kill that guy up there somehow we did kill all these guys so where's the way out Apart from over the waterfall again.
Oh yes, I vaguely remember this spot. I think the better place to come out is over there. But I'm probably wrong. Uh... This feel, yeah, this sort of feels right. Uh, I think this way. Actually, there really shouldn't be much in the way of enemies around here. Yeah, there's another temple there. Let's go back to the Shrine of Learning. I think we went the wrong way. Come on, I think I did that last time I got stuck on that rock. Uh, sight, radiance, resolution, learning. There we go. Uh, so, here's the exit there. Northwest. Near the path up to the Paragon platform. It says it's the opposite end of the river that leads to the Dark Fall Grotto, which is where we just were, so. Basically, let's just dip down this way, actually. So, the path up to the Paragon Shrine. Not sure where that is. So, I thought it was up there somewhere. But we'll look out around here for... A frost giant. Actually, it's probably down there somewhere. Shouldn't be going up like that. It's more malachite ore. Ooh. Caves like these sort of look like what I have seen the frost giants in previously. So let's have a look at those. Okay, that's not really a cave per se, that one. Nor is that. Go back across to the other side. Near the path to the Paragon platform. There he is. What size soul did we get? That gave us a grand soul, just as I expected.
Okay, and the last one... Beyond the Shrine of Resolution, before the Glacial Crevice. Go to the Shrine of Resolution. Uh, so... I think this is meant to be the path up to the Paragon Shrine? What they implied? Why can I not run at the moment? What's going on? Oh, I am sneaking. Of course I'm sneaking. Right, we want to head back over this way. We'll go back to the Shrine of Resolution, and then I've got details from there how to get to it. And then we'll make our way to the Paragon Portal and try all of the gems. Site Resolution. So, from Resolution, Rock Bridge to the north. Let's get our standard crossbow back for the moment, just in case. Across the Ross Bridge to the north, turn left, heading west, yeah. Down to a Falmer camp. That's the Falmer camp down there. Turn right and climb the canyon to a second rock bridge. So that'd be that. Follow the path to a Falmer bridge. I'm assuming it doesn't actually say to go across this Falmer Bridge. It just says follow the path to a Falmer Bridge, but there's no other choice. There's nothing else here. So we cross the Falmer Bridge and it says turn left and cross a third rock bridge. So left. In you past Sharp Slope Cave. Okay. A well, one pay path. Before reaching the top of the Western Canyon, there's a fenced area to the right. The Frost Giant is located. Don't know if we're still going the right way, but we'll cross this bridge. I feel like we're going the wrong way. That's Sharp Slope Cave. Hang on. Turn around. Oh. 
What's in here? Nothing we want. Uh, so... We've got Sharp Slope Cave just there. I think we've gone slightly wrong because we don't have access to Sharp Slope. Oh, yes, we do. That's... No, that's not the entrance to Sharp Slope Cave. So, was there somewhere we were supposed to go up? Maybe. So, I feel like Sharp Slope Cave is up above us somewhere. That's... That's the northern entrance to Sharp Slope Cave, though. I feel like this is going the wrong way. We need to be going... I feel like we need to be coming down this area more. I don't know. Getting all turned around again. Nothing we can do about that here. We've got to go this way. Uh... Ah, here we go. Yes, this is the area where he is. Second Grand Soul Gem. Second Grand Soul Gem. Very nice. Chorus, etc. And... There we are. We have all of those gems. So now, we've got to make our way to the... Paragon Portal. Excuse me, Paragon Portal. Way Shrine of Learning. Okay. Can we fast travel back to... No, of course we can't fast travel from here. Uh, hang on. Maybe if we go this way. Uh, oop. This way. I don't feel like we're going the right way anymore.
so what did we say go to the ray shine of learning there we go and northwest where is the exit there we go and northwest follow your way along the water until you see a path rising up a series of flight of steps the shore opposite the frost giant who carries well I always felt the easiest way was over this way but it's just up there sure I gotta swim a little bit but no big deal Probably is a faster path up another way. Is that? No, every now and then I hear a noise that sounds like bugs. Like whether it's the chorus or something like that. And that noise happens a lot. It comes from um, Serena a lot as well. Which is super annoying because she'll be standing next to me and it's like, what the hell is that noise? Oh, it's just her. Moonstone, Moonstone. Miss that potion. So this isn't where you put the portal. It's over here, is it? I thought it was somewhere around here. This is May Ariel's glow shield you from So we were supposed to go up a set of stairs. Where is it? About midway up, not to the top, until you're level with the top of the waterfall on your right. At this point turn northeast and keep going okay let's actually follow the instructions rather than i know where it is going to the wrong spot so we're going to way shrine of learning series of stairs going uh, on the opposite shore from where we found the frost giant like there's no stairs here is that referring to oh maybe it's not up there maybe it's up that way oh, no thank you Let's be risky and put the bow away. So, what was that? Oh, that was Harvest the Snowberries. So, I think I know what it means. We killed him here. It's talking about those stairs there. You go halfway up. Till you're level with the top of the waterfall.
turn northeast. This is the top of the waterfall. Turn northeast and keep going. And the near shore to the left is the platform. Oh, here it is. Right. Let's do them all. We've done... I don't remember which one we've done already. I've never noticed the followers having that sound before. But yeah, you may be right, because I don't usually have a follower who has magic. Okay, this is the Sapphire. Get... Well, we're out just in case. This will be the one that we've already been to. Yep. Okay, so Sapphire we did previously. Let's... Just do the rest in order. Let's pick up our... Socket... Do the next one. Emerald. Rotten Vale Overlook. And what is it, Forgotten Vale Overlook? Okay, so apparently... There is not much here, but if I head over the river... East along the bank... Actually, I'm not entirely sure I was supposed to head to this bank. But somewhere down here... Yeah, no, I wasn't supposed to head there. Somewhere down here is a little clearing with a skeleton. Uh, yeah, here we go. Orcish Bow of Thunderbolts, Book 2, which we've been looking for, some Elven Arrows, Chest, and, oops, and that. And an Elven Greatsword of Expelling. That was the enchantment that I got off the, uh, I said I found another magical item that's what i got off that magical item was the enchantment of expelling which banishes summoned creatures including daedra um i find it very situational not all that useful but yeah so we're making our way back to the part to this thing so we can take it back i also just because I'm like this, and I sort of have to do this every time, I just want to make sure there's nothing behind the waterfall. And hopefully I won't get swept away to my death. Yeah, there ain't nothing back there. It's just stone. Very good. Okay, back through the gateway. On to the next. What's next? Uh, Ruby.
this is the guy we were looking for before. Is that it? I wasn't looking for the frost troll. I was looking for this guy. Because he has Oriole's shield. I don't want the Falmet heavy armor. Don't think there's anything else here that's all of that useful. It's just so hard to see what's around here because there's so much in the way of trees. There's... Oh, there's a chest. And a skeleton with a few gold on him. Yeah, and another frost troll. Take that gold. And this looks like about it. What the hell is that? Oh, just another frost troll. So that was Ruby. Two to go. Amethyst. Don't push me. That's all there is here, that single chest. Okay, that's fine. And then finally, diamond. around this one either except for this chest right well I can now say I've done all of those. I've found all of the gems and I have, excuse me, done everything to do with that. Let's quickly go home, drop those gems off. Uh, yeah, it really, there, no, is there a way to get the map back to normal? After you've been up there, because it's basically twisted the map like 30 degrees counterclockwise, no, clockwise. We can now put all of those away and there's Oriole's shield hey, why didn't you get put away and you get put away there we go that is everything in that little alcove very nice uh, do we have anything to disenchant nope we will have a couple of filled soul gems to put away. I 
don't think I'm going to get anything to fill black soul gems at this point. Uh, I do sort of want to go and get some giants. I mean, I've got so many. No, actually, I don't think I do. Now that I think about it, I've got so many filled grand soul gems and I've got, I've got 22 of them. And if I want to sell anything, I almost have to buy more soul gems just to sell stuff because when it comes down to it, I, I can't sell what I've got. I mean, what I probably need to do, if I'm entirely honest, not that I'm not being honest with you, but what I probably need to do is spend a couple of points in speech. Where is it? I got level 67 to speech, right? I probably need to set, to put, to get up here to investor. I mean, eventually Master Trader would be good too. But going down this path here, um, just investor there means that most of the merchants then have more money, which I can use to sell stuff to them. Why do I need to do some alchemy? I'm trying to get a way to be out. Look, I've got this cupboard here just absolutely full. No, I'm not trying to get money. I have a problem where I have stuff that is worth so much that I can't sell it to any um, merchants. Right, I've got items here that, well, for example, I'm going to be putting this great sword of expelling. That's going to be sold. That's 2,712 gold. I can't just rock up to any old merchant. Why do I have so much junk? Because I can't sell it all. I'm not, I don't want to take the time to sell it right now. I'm in the middle of trying to do quests, right? And then I have this problem that so much of it is worth so much that when I go to a store and they can only buy 750 gold worth of stuff, I've either got to sell something that's worth twice that or a tiny amount of gold and then move on. No, I don't think it's worth a lot. What I'm getting at is I have so much stuff to, to sell and nobody has the funds to be able to buy it. Like I can't even go and sell a couple of these rings that I just made. So I need some way to get the merchants to have more money, which was why I was going to go down the speech tree, right? Because if I do some, put some points, I, I know I can make a lot of money from alchemy. I've done all that before. It doesn't interest me at all, right? But it's this is not about me making money. It's about getting rid of all this stuff that I have lying around. I've got 60,000 gold just sitting in here in a, in a chest that I'm not using, right? This is not about making the money it's about i've got all this stuff that i found while adventuring and when i try and sell it nobody can afford it so i end up having to buy things from the merchants so that i can then sell something to them which was worth more than they originally had the money for so i have to spend money to sell something back to the merchant um, so what I'm getting at is if I go down the speech route as far as skills, right, then once I get to 
uh, well, first of all, once I get to Merchant, if I put a couple of perk points in here, then I can sell any item to any kind of merchant. So it doesn't matter who they are, if I've got the money, I can sell it to them, which is nice. But more importantly, Investor increases the amount of money that those merchants will then have. So if I spend 500 gold, I can invest 500 gold with a shopkeeper and then I can come back later and they will permanently, every time I come back to them, they will have more money to buy stuff that I wanna sell every single time. So it's it's worthwhile getting this. At this point in the game, when I'm level 38, I'm just at this situation where I have so much stuff that I don't need, that I wanna get rid of, and I can't sell it because it's all worth more than most merchants have coin to buy it. So, So I just, I need some way to make it easier to do that. That's what I'm getting at. It doesn't matter if I can do it only one time or what the deal is. I just need some way to make it easier for me to be able to sell stuff because at the moment, all this stuff that I've got here, I go on a selling run and I go around every single store Yeah, I'm not planning on ranking up to Legendary. So that's not going to be a problem. If that erases all my, my stuff. Um, anyway, I think I... What am I still carrying that's heavy? It's the damn... Uh, it's the damn scrolls, isn't it? It is. It's the Elder Scrolls. And I can get rid of those books in a minute... I've got nothing in there. What was I... There was something I was just thinking I need to do. Oh, the void salts. Make up some more... Uh, press... Uh, make up some more exploding bolts. Before we head out. Even though I'm not really using them as much as I should. There we go. How many of those do I have now? I have... 336. Wonderful. So, the plan was to continue on with the Dawnguard questline. If I do that, though, I miss out on an advantage, I've just realised, because... The new guy that we just recently hired for the Dawn Guard, Florentus, has some quests. So we're going to do those first. Then we're going to go and kill Harkin. That'll give us the best advantage we can get. You have Oriel's bow. Yep, I sure do. Where is Florentus going to be? Actually, I think he's usually down this way. Uh, there we go. Arke says it's good that we're here, but I don't know. Something about this place doesn't feel right. What? No, 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 no. Yes. Yes, I see. All right. Right. I'll settle in, and then Arke and I will start to put things right. Don't you worry. Oh, he sells stuff? Oh, my friend. Potions, possibly some spells, maybe some other things I've forgotten about. Actually, I'm not sure. Let's see, shall we? I'll take the void salt, so. Okay. Didn't know that spell existed. There you go. Couple of nice spells there. Um, but that's not what we're here for. What can I do to help? Gunmar. He has something for you. Really? I've done Gunmar's quests a dozen times. Like... You're telling me I've got to do Gunmar's quests again? Go 
fuzzy little place, isn't this? I've learned of it, and while I do not know its exact where, pay a visit to the beast's last known contact. Do it, then root out the monster and destroy it. Fight bravely, friend. Okay, we're gonna do this because I really want the Dawn Guard rune weapons. Uh, hunting the monster. Where are we going to hunt monster? Oh, Soulstone. No? No. Hang on. Oh, no, it is Soulstone. Raven Rock. Yes. Very good. Captain Gallen does the business around here. I don't know what you did in those mines. Oh, that letter's the last I've heard of him and mentions where he is. Now, please, leave me alone. I was always taught to avoid these types of rooms. I think I still There's still one in the other building. Don't get rid of my vampire effects. It did. Wonderful. Mm.
I'm positive I've looked at that book more than once before and it's never given me that quest. But anyway. Skyrim. If you're looking for Pascal, talk to Captain. Cozy little place, isn't this? For those who cherish memories of loved ones, their compassion often conceals. Yes? Arke's been what I once killed 30 vampires with my bare hands, you know. Ask Arke, he'll tell you. Don't you worry about me. Oh, I've read the story, that only I hear that's heard they'd go on midnight. R.K. tells me the Sunfire spell can break open those caches, but I've never found one. What do you want? This is fine for now, but we can't stay holed up here forever. The bow. Indeed. But what of Serana? I suppose that let me address the Dawn Guard and then we'll be off. The men no. deserve to know that we finally gained the upper hand. I, I'm not doing this yet. To this one day, I knew. It is my sworn duty to see Arke's wrath delivered to all the undead. It's usually a good bit of fun too. Farewell. Need something? Farewell. Allow those vampires to poison the night and kill our people. Now, we finally have the means to strike back. We now have Ariel's bow. The gods themselves have favored us, and we must answer with action. The time has come to finally put an end to Harkon and his unholy prophecy. We will march on their lair and destroy those wretched abominations so they can no longer corrupt our world. This is our fight, and this is our fate. This is the time of the Dawn Guard. Fuck them all! This is the last bullet to look between the eyes for me. Arke be with you, my friend. Farewell. Friend! Right, I can't do that quest line. Is there a potential bug noted about it? No, there isn't. Uh, I want to go up to College of Winterhold. And let's give these books to Urag. Again. Huh. 
Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's going to stay pristine, understand? Well, well. I haven't seen one of these beauties in a long time. A rare find in the original Thalmer language. You're damn right I'm interested. Question is, are you selling? Well, considering no one else in Skyrim would buy something they couldn't possibly read, I'd say you don't have much of a choice. Tell you what, you bring me books like this, and I'll pay a thousand gold each. I'll even throw in a translated edition I have for free. Interested? Here you go. Let's go drop these books home. Okay, we will make our dwarven bolts. It's time we take the fight to gather your things and rest well, my friend. We meet outside Castle Mugahar. Stay alert. Arke says we're going to win this. Well, probably. Arke says we're going to win this. Okay, so they're all heading off there. Looks like there's no way I can do those subquests now. So I've done this all wrong. It also looks like I probably need to grab Oriel's bow. I don't understand why, but I will go home. I will grab Oriel's bow. And I might as well grab the sun arrows that we've got and maybe even go up to what's his face and get some more uh i think i put the sun hill there there and that now if we're going to to take oriel's bow 
What sort of damage is that rocking at the moment? That's rocking 103. I'm sorry, that's just not good enough. What can I upgrade this with? Refined Moonstone. Let's get... our smithing gear and let's just see what we can get it to when we put our smithing gear on sixty one to hundred and thirty four still not anywhere near as good as the ebony crossbow uh, might as well it feels like a bit of a waste to use this potion but we might as well oh and I need uh, moonstone, wasn't it? Refined moonstone. Actually, let's just get one of each in case I was wrong. And I'll check these before I actually do the upgrade. Yes, it was refined moonstone. So let's drink the potion. Blacksmithing. Upgrade you. One fit. 159 there we go and then with all of my archery gear back on what are we looking at 229 as opposed to 323 yeah okay well it is what it is oh sorry I did have one refined malachite there then I gotta put away. Oh no, I need to equip that. Actually, the weapon will be a little bit high now. 267 as opposed to 376. How many arrows do I actually have there? Uh. 12 of those, I still feel my exploding crossbow. Let's actually look at it. So, if I equip this with those, it's now saying 283 total. 390 total. Yeah. It's no competition at all, but if I go back to here, I'll get, at least get this guy to make me up some more. Um, some more arrows. If there's assistance I can provide, absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. So if you want the rest of your arrows blessed, let me... Absolutely. I can only... Absolutely. I Certainly. I can only do 20 at a time. I'm afraid I'll need elven arrows if you want me to produce the site. That's fine. Uh, we're supposed to be meeting outside the castle, aren't we? Let's get indoors. Or in a cave. Uh, let's favour that... And put it on the four like we did with the other one. There we go. Uh, so. Yeah. Okay. We're done with this when none of them are left standing. Let's go.
Okay, let's go. I only shot one person by mistake. Why am I going so slow? There we are, because I'm aiming where I shouldn't be. Maybe I should loot after we kill Arkan. really giving me any direction that I should be going. been summoned. Oh, that's considered stealing. Okay. Probably all that stuff I picked up is considered stolen, is it? really sure why it should be considered stolen, but anyway. You know, Serena, you could actually give us a little help and tell us which way we're actually supposed to go. The fact that we're all hanging around up here, maybe this is the way to go. Serena, my darling, I see you still favor keeping a pet. You know why we're here. Of course I do. You disappoint me. Rana, you've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for this pathetic being. Provided for me? Are you insane? You've destroyed our family. You've killed other vampires all over some prophecy that we barely understand. No more. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Your voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. 
how alike you've become. No. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. And you. About me. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I knew it was only a matter of time before she'd return with hatred in her heart. A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. Yes, yes. Always the noble vampire hunter. And what happens when you've slain me? Is Valerica next? Is yep. Serana? Yep. I see. Interesting that you can set aside your... Yes, quite. I'll give you a single chance to turn over the bow to me. Very well, then. You leave me no choice. And we're done. That's annoying. An empty chest. Well, now that's done. I'm not sure. I'll probably stay with the Dawn Guard for as long as they'll let me. They're respectable fighters, and I think they see the benefits of having a vampire on their side now. Of course, if you've got any more adventures planned, suit yourself. So. The beast is destroyed. It is indeed. Say that. But I... It's over. Dead. And the... Prophecy dies with him. I... I suppose. Grand soul in a black soul gem. Potion of blood. Oh, thank you. A place of magic suppression. Thank you. Eminent destruction. Replenishing. More vampire royal armor. And then Harkin's sword. Absorbs 15 points of health, magicka, and stamina if wielded by a vampire. I think you did more than that. You have my thanks.
So that's it. Everyone's just left me all alone. Okay. So I had to have that bow. I forgot from the last time I played this, but yes, I had to have Oriel's bow because it was required to um, to break down some of his uh, protection type stuff. Owned coffins so I can't sleep in them. I find it very strange that all this stuff is actually marked as steel. I mean, I have literally defeated the owner of this place. searched him before, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't, actually. Well, if I did, I didn't take everything. Okay, don't talk to me then, Isran. See if I care. Okay, I'm going to briefly... That's probably a little bit too far, actually. I'm going to briefly go back to Fort Dawnguard. See if Florentus is there and if I can still potentially do his quests to get the Dawnguard rune hammer, shield, and axe. I don't know if I can, but... I want to at least try... I knew you. Arke has been watching over me for years now. Arke has some. Your friend. A vicious night stalker rules over a group of bad. Arke is never clear on life and death. Is she still alive? There's always hope. No. I try to avoid it. Always seems to end in an argument. You? Why you think. While I doubt we'll ever be. Hope you're getting along with Isran. I'll buy whatever you're looking to get rid of. All right, then. Go. Congrats. This is fine for me. Keep yourself armed and protected as best you can. Take care of 
Okay, so we've got a quest. want me to go. Fort Fellhammer. I have not been there before. Let's... Where are we? Everything's a little bit twisted still. There we are. Mia watch. We'll put away Oriel's bow. We'll put away Harkin's sword because I'm pretty sure I, can, I have places for all of those. So, no, where was it? Oriel's bow is back in its place. Uh, Arkin's sword. And then we've got to get those. Got a lot of ore. Got maybe one potion to sell. That's right, I wanted to check to make sure I don't need to disenchant that. Yeah, no, I've already got that magic suppression. I thought I did, but it was best to check anyway. Um, I think that was thunder at my house. Let's have a look. If there is a storm coming, I may have to cut this stream short. Oh, yep, yeah, there is a storm coming. There is a possibility I might lose internet soon. I hope we don't. But if we do, that's going to cut the stream a little bit short. Let's put away all of those. That and that. I don't need that. And we'll put of those away. Let's quickly try and do this quest. Uh, yeah, let's see if we can get there easily from the Hall of the Vigilant. Well, it's not still bad guys. No, there isn't. didn't kill him.
what I wanted. Uh, I need to get up on there, which is a long way around. If anything interesting. Uh, let's forget about getting that. Let's get in here. Everything he had was worthwhile. Uh, but where's Gerda? I thought I'm supposed to be rescuing her. strips okay yeah I am still supposed to be rescuing her Okay. Well. Why can I not pick up that bolt? It's just sitting there and it's one of mine. What about you? Lockpick, dwarven arrows, dwarven bolts, dwarven bow, and orcish dagger. Let's sneak so we get the best out of this. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. I don't know why they thought Gerda was a... Oh, hang on, I did do the... I did the... Um, okay. I was going to say, I didn't do that start. I did the Imperial start, but I didn't. I don't think these are the quests to get 
the relics at all. I once killed 30 vampires with my... I know. Arke told me of your success. I've been poring over some of the tomes left here in the key. That's what we're looking for. Interesting story. Seems the previous incarnation of... Arke and I think it could be a great advantage. For a powerful warhammer imbued with magic that places warding runes on the ground to obliterate its wielder's foes. Hm. Sounds useful. What's that, Lord? Okay, nothing you can't handle. Go with the light. Do, 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 do. Where are we off to? That looks vaguely familiar. Maybe not. Uh, we might go to Lost Echo Cave and see if it's easier to come back towards it from that way. The area around um, Dragon Bridge is... Yeah. It's not the best to navigate. How far do we have to go? Too much. What did I have in the way of I've got some I have a petty soul gym? Okay, it's gonna be better than nothing. I need to charge my bow. I'm on the lookout for filled soul gems. I mean, I can always go home and get some, but... Let's go. Trap was so obvious.
Alt. Nothing. bit of damage that that's going to do yeah I don't care Ooh, last mace uh, right hmm it's kind of hoping that would set off the rune that less a soul gem all right not something I've done much here before in this playthrough but if that's what it takes to get those uh, wards out of the way and I don't have a bit I don't have a problem So, what's behind this door? Ooh, master lock. to be just a touch further does so no that's too far it's close that's really close Got it. Yeah, there is definitely something bugged with the level 100 uh, perk for archery, at least when you're using a crossbow, that it seems to apply the, uh, what's the name effect? Seems to apply the paralysis effect before the bolt even hits them and they often fall down and the bolt completely misses them which just seems really wrong I need to see where this leads this might actually be a dead end that was a complete miss somehow There we go. And has some gold. Uh, 
And you don't have anything. A. Nothing there. Actually, that key would have probably got me through that master lock without having to pick it. Or sworn missive. Uh, but, 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 yeah. Nothing super special. We'll, we'll take it with us. The, the, uh, Red Eagle thing. Yeah, don't really want that. Oh, Ring of Lock Picking. There we go. I thought I already had that enchantment, but obviously not. Oh, and we can't go anywhere there. Okay, now it all makes sense. I was supposed to go through there before I did this lock. All good. Then we come up here. Go all the way along here, and then we go through the door. Over. Yeah. Oh. Ocean to sell, because I don't want it for anything else. Deepwood Veil. Isn't this interesting? Oh, he would stop. Why do they always stop the minute I shoot? It's one down. And then... I'm supposed to go this way. And this way. And done. Fishing spot here. What was that? Anyone else? No? Oh, dwarven bolt. Another dwarven bolt. Another dwarven bolt. Oh, oh cheese wedge. Dwarven bolt. Lucky carrot. Just didn't do it for you this time, mate. That was right through the head. Take that bolt back. Amethyst. Dwarven bolt. Okay. Dagger. Thing there. Right over here. Up top we have 
Black Soul Gym. I mean, I could have filled a few Black Soul Gems by now if I had have uh, brought my Soul Trapping bow along with me. Where did you come from? You're not supposed to be here. Okay, well. There we go. Make you feel better to do all that. Sweep, sweep, sweep. I'm hitting you with two weapons at once and I'm really bad at it. Because, uh, yeah. It just seemed a little bit weird, let's put it that way. Elven armor. Amethyst. Oh, greater soul gem. Thank you. Been looking for that to recharge the bow. There we go. Almost back to normal. In purse. Nothing else there I want. Thought I uh, would die. Ominous music for one Forsworn Briar Heart. Who, if I had been sneaking, I could have taken out with a single shot. Thank you, thank you. Just a normal steel battle axe. Admin of the Reach. Shield. Frontier. Conquest. No, I don't want the book. I wanted to search the dresser. And there's nothing in there. Okay, the chest. The Rune Guard Hammer. Wonderful. Well, I'm here, and this place is called Hag's End. I feel like... Maybe I should do something about that. Because hags are nasty things. And I feel like... It might be a good idea... To try and get rid of them. Even if there's only... <laughs> that all three? What was that? Three bad guys. Three bolts. Four bad guys, five bolts. It's still, it's not that bad, all right? Ah, 
excuse me, while I get rid of this continuing nuisance that is people trying to sell followers. That and block, close and ban and done. All right. So there was the witch up here, and then there was the hag. Where'd she go? Where did she go? She run through the door and escape. I feel like she must have, because I don't see her body. I thought she died a little easily. Not that I felt like it really needed more than... One or two hits to kill a hag. Probably shouldn't have bothered with the silver boots, but... I think there's a word wall here. Great soul gem. Damn it, I did not notice that rune there. Ebony bow. I noticed that rune there. Right, anything else I want here? There might be something in the burial urn. Feels like I might be safe. Oh, there's nothing else there. Okay, that means that the witch, if the hag, if she did survive, had to have gone through this door. We got a potion of extreme healing a minute ago, so we might as well just use that now. There's, there's someone over there, but I don't know. I don't know where they could be. I think this hag just keeps running from me. Well, 
I mean, there is a small chance it's not a secret door. But I also don't see a trigger for it. Oh. No, that just does that. All right. Wasn't going to, but I think I'm going to start sneaking a bit more. Yep, yeah, every time I hit that hag, he disappears. I search this body. Well, I obviously did because I took some stuff off her. Uh, just trying to see if there's any bees here that will open up that door that was there. I don't need. That's not there. Uh, that will take that. Right. That soul gem there. Oh, and that closed that behind me. Very interesting. Uh, so what's through here then? was literally, literally one click to the left. That's all it was to get through that. Okay, we can't go that way. Done everything in here. Don't know that there's actually anything worthwhile in here, but... Gives me some experience trying to get through the lock. And I've got more... More lock picks than... Ooh. I know what to do with. Okay. It needs to be a little bit further than that. That is very close. How about... Maybe a touch further, like that. Too far. Okay. So we know the bounds. That's still too far. That is super close to it. Got it.
Yeah. That was experience. Is the word wall? Finally got her. Oh, Bloodthorn. There we go. That name vaguely rings a bell. I think I have somewhere to store that back at home. Have a look. Actually, I wonder what's going to happen if I go and put the um, the hammer. Yeah, I can't put that hammer there yet because. No, I don't think Bloodthorn is one of the named daggers up there. What does it do, by the way? Bloodthorn. Oh, is that all? Okay. Not that special. I'll just put it up here. So I have to complete the quest first to be able to um, have anything else to put away. I have to complete the quest, uh, go back and complete the quest for the rune hammer before I can store it here. So. Uh, duh, 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 I got that filled got that filled. How am I doing for charges on the bow actually? Uh, not that. Weapons. That. Yeah, that's alright. Okay. Um, oh, another rumble of thunder. Let's grab that again and then let's put away those, that. Hey, St. Salvius. How you doing?
Uh, shouldn't put that in there. The flawless amethyst should stay and go back upstairs. Where will it be? Right there. Well, I hope the hope the drive isn't too bad today. Let's go and put those away. I'm not sure how long the stream's going to go for because there's a storm brewing here, so my internet could go down. Depends on if we actually get any rain or if it's just going to pass over. watching over me for years. Well done. I said you'd return victorious. RK wasn't so sure. Wield it bravely. Speak with Gunmar. He has something for you. RK, bless you. Don't want to speak with Gunmar. Cozy little place, isn't this? I've learned about it. And while I do not know its exact whereabouts, I do have information. I hate these quests. I just want Florentus to give me all of the quests so I can get three drawn guard relics. Does it have to be that hard? Um, we're probably not following that quest. Hunting the monitor, the monster. Where does it say we need to go? We need to go to. No, we don't need to go to Fort Dawnguard. We need to go to Dawnstar. Okay. But not before we travel all the way back home to quickly put the rune hammer up on the wall. talking about where did I put it did I put it away downstairs before What is going on? I don't have it on me.
I'm super confused. I have retrieved the Dawnguard rune hammer from Deepwood Redoubt. I did that. I showed it to Florentus. He said, wield it with whatever. And now I don't have it. Like. Am I not wearing? Oh no, those are. I need to put those away. It's not. I don't have the required item, but I did have the required item. Like, I put Bloodthorn there, but that's it. Putting the weapon on any weapon display furniture will cause it to disappear. Okay. We're here to teach you a lesson. What was the contract for? It was for stealing, it was probably for stealing the stuff from Castle Valkyrie, even though I dropped it all. Who's Modna? I don't know. Doesn't matter, these guys can barely hurt me. Put all this stuff away back in the never sell chest. Should have used. If I had been thinking, I would have used the other bow against those guys and got some black soul gems filled. Anyway, we're going up to Dawnstar.
Lady Mara, I don't know what you're talking about. Well, um, that letter is the last I've heard of him and mentions where he is. Now, please, leave me alone. I'll gulch mine. That rings a bell, but... I can't remember exactly where it is. I know I've done it before, so... Down this way, Bile Gulch Mine. Oh, yes, this is the yes, this place. Now, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. I think we can stick with that. Uh, Standard bolts for this. Been a while since I leveled up. Grand soul in the black soul gem. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, that went right over the top of them. One grand soul and missed. Two grand souls. Do, 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 do. We got up here today. Orcish sword and orcish helmet, and the rest is just frankly junk. Okay. Do I actually have any more? No, I doubt. If I kill anybody else. That I am going to get. Another soldier. Why? I didn't even say anything about. Is he a vampire? No, that was the bandit chief. Where are you? Huh? Where is he? Not down here.
Oh, he's got to be up higher. I forgot there was another level up there. No, he's... No, that's the exit. See so, yeah. how... Uh, it says he's inside somewhere. But he's not. is weird it says he's through there somewhere let's see he's stuck let's go out and come back in see if that resolves anything same time I'm not sure I want to continue much with these quests uh, particularly now that the yeah it's still bugged this quest is bugged the rune hammer was bugged it's like Nothing's going quite right. I don't know where... I mean, unless there's something secret in this mine that I've never known about. And there is something funny going on. See how it sounds like I'm jumping and landing all the time? Not all the time. It went again. It's not all the time, but it happens every few steps. There. There is still something funny going on. try something. Let's wait for a day. See if that resets anything. Still busted.
try reloading the save I did outside. Now let's go back in. What the hell? That worked. Reload the save. Well, Mia Watch Gallery contains a special holder for the Dawnguard Rune Hammer. Is what it says. So maybe I ended up giving it to Florentus when I. Cozy little place, isn't it? For those who cherish memory. Our oh, compassion compels us to destroy it. I found another beast hiding from the light of Yeah, I don't care about that actually. Okay has been watching over me for years now. Speak with Gunmar. Yeah. He has something for you. This is fine for now, but we can't stay hold up here forever. Our sense of what's right. I've he's holed up with a we need to destroy him before he turns his comrades into a brood of vampires. Actually, I wonder if... Now that I've loaded that save, I wonder if going to Mere Watch... I don't know what it is with these Dawnguard side quests. It's actually bugging me that you go and do a quest for Florentus, and then he says, oh, you need to go and do some more for Gunma. I've done these Gunma quests time and time again. Um, still no sign of the rune hammer. Okay, here's a really stupid way to see if it's in this. Pick up everything. I would have thought it would be right between those two. So something has definitely gone funky.
so there's not going to be a lot here because most of the stuff I can't get rid of. chuck these soul gems back upstairs. I don't think I'm going to worry. I've only got... I don't have any more black soul gems. So the chances of me being able to fill any other souls, any other gems up, you know, I know I can fill a grand soul, but only with like a giant. I'm not sure what does graders, but it's probably like mammoths, and that's about it. Oh, actually. On that, let's just chuck in there for the moment. Like I said, I'm not going to use it. Where did this next quest want me to go? At Winter War. Where the hell is Winter War? Ooh. I have not been there before. Well, I have, but not in this playthrough. There was a saber cat up there. I thought it might have been a, it might have been chasing after me from behind. Where? Why did you just run away? You ran towards the danger, not away from it. these back because had a few little mishaps there and didn't quite hit our shots. Didn't really want to do that, but he got aggressive, so...
Thought I might have got nudged by a swimming hawker there for a moment, but I don't know. Let's sneak into position. What the hell? That's been a long time coming. I'll do all that again. Snave. Sneak time. How did that miss? Right, much better this time. Although, what helmet is he wearing? Dragon insulated cuirass. Oh yeah, I don't think I can upgrade that yet. Not effectively, but it looks badass, that's for sure. Bandit thug. I think that was a little bit off-putting in the last battle, was I saw that guy coming at me and I'm going, what the hell is that helmet that he's got on? That was what I noticed initially. And I was having to, um, you know, it was between the vampire attacking me with spells and this guy running at me wearing some weird helmet I've never seen before. 
was most off-putting. Oh, yes, chest here. Another dragon insulated cuirass. Uh -huh. da -da 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 -da. not yes that is heavy armor so i am going to check it out i'm going to go to fort dawn guard first finish this quest and see if i can get the next quest from florentus to get the uh it's either the rune axe or the rune shield um How come I have two quests? And no one believed. Cozy little place, isn't this? Excellent. That's one less beast and nest of broodlings we needn't worry about any longer. Arke's been watching over me for years. Speak with Gunma. Oh, come on. Arke? No. I've had it. I'm not doing any more of these quests. Just to get items that are going to despawn on me anyway. We're going to go home and we're going to have a look at this heavy armor and see what it takes to upgrade it. I'm pretty sure because I don't have dragon smithing yet, which is at a level 100, I am not going to be able to do anything, well, not anything special with it. Um, but I'm curious to see what it requires to upgrade. I do have... A dragon bone. I don't even remember where I got it from. Yeah, it requires dragon bone to upgrade. So, I mean, in its current state, it's not going to be anywhere near my armor but i do want to put it somewhere and we do have one more mannequin right here Okay, I can still hear thunder rumbling in the background. I am not sure how much longer I'm... I mean, I have had zero dropped frames today, which is great. But, if it starts to rain outside, all bets are off. That's why the stream came, uh, died early the other night. So I think I'm going to leave it here. Um, I really, really wanted to get the Dawnguard Rune Hammer, the Dawnguard Rune Shield, and the Dawnguard Rune Axe. I got the hammer, and then lost it somehow. I don't know whether Laurentis took it, or whether me trying to put it on the weapon stand caused it to disappear, or whether I put it in that cupboard and that caused it to disappear, I don't recall. All I know is it's a little disappointing that it's gone. Um, 
So we have killed Harkin. We have essentially finished the Dawnguard quest line with the exception of those side quests. I think next episode, it's time to get into the main quest line just enough so that we can then go over to Solestein and start doing stuff over there, which I said I really wanted to do. Also, maybe it's time to spend a little bit more time doing some smithing. We are at level 90 now, which is enough for us to get Daedric smithing, which means we could get the Daedric crossbow, which does a little bit more damage than the ebony. Um, but if we can push hard and get to 100 smithing, we can get dragon. We can update that dragon insulated armor that we just found. We can get the dragon bone bow and annihilate everything. Um, so I think we might do a little bit of smithing next episode and then go and do a run through um, the, the start of the main quest line. So I hope you've enjoyed this, everyone. I'm still having fun. I'm really enjoying this. I will catch you all next time. Bye now.